Do my short. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, Thank you. 
activity when you achieve great feet, usually, and they say because the work is green, it will infer that you got good luck. But this good luck comes out of a foundation. And especially in your own case, since becoming Nigeria's president, you led from the front. In the sports sector, especially with our president, you started with a very defining decision. You considered and you appreciated the enormous importance of sports. It's a great, 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 great day for all of us. Uh, you can see how the president received the, the team, and uh, we're highly excited to say that uh, we were being honored with, uh, with, uh, with a great honor of MON, a member of the Order of the Niger, to all of the entire team, and including even myself and my general secretary. That is a great thing that will have ever happened to this country. Uh, that shows that Nigerians are really happy, especially our president and commander in chief of the armed forces. Uh, we really thank everybody for the support given to this team. And by the grace of God, we are going to continue to do our best to ensure that we make Nigerians happy through football. So, What's next? Um, very quickly, uh, the team is going to reconvert for the match for the World Cup for the finals. As we know, um, the results are a bit shaky, but what sort of team are we expecting? What should Nigeria be looking after? After this, uh, the next qualifier is coming in June, not in March. And uh, we have a people window that we are trying to organize a high-quality, high uh, friendly matches for the team, for them to prepare for, for, for that uh, very important match we are talking about in June. And that will take place in March during the people window. And by the grace of God, we will give the coach all the necessary support he needed for us to see that at least uh, still we we'll go back to our feet uh, in the next uh, round of qualifier. And speaking about coach, are we still having... That that this year will be taken very soon. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Tell us about that and your message to Nigerians. Yeah, thank you very much. Yeah, we know that we are very disappointed with the result, but there is nothing we can do. That is what happened in football. So now we have to go back and work ahead for the next Afcon, and we have some more couple of games for the World Cup qualifiers. So that is more important. Uh, we really appreciate all Nigeria for the massive support that they do to us. It's not that easy. We know everyone won the cup, but that is what Allah decided that is going to happen. Yeah, for our colleague, I don't think uh, he deserves what he is getting now because uh, I think we have done our, our we have we have done our nation proud. So we we think everyone have to be proud of each of any one of us. But nowadays we saw in the social media everything. If you want to attack, just attack all the team, not individual players. So for we, we are just playing with everyone that is that have that mindset. You should just think we are women. There is nothing we can do. We made a mistake in life, but when something like this happens, so we have to come together as unity and appreciate one, one another. Was there a lesson learned from the last match, the, the, the final match? Yeah, there is a yeah, there is a lot of lesson. You know, uh, we are thinking. And we are hoping that we're going to win the cup, but at the end of 95 minutes, we lost, we lost the game. So I think that is a very big lesson that we have to go back and look into it. Thank you, okay. Thank, Thank, you. Thank, Thank you so much. much. Okay. Well done, okay. Captain. Okay. 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 Are you ready?
you ready? Yes. Okay, so the president just hosted you and your team members. What's your reaction to that? <sighs> it's so nice today, like to be honest, it's so nice, like um, it have been my dreams, like um, meeting the president, like, but today it's so nice, like I, I won't talk about my reaction because me looking at my face, you see that I'm so happy today and even my, my teammates, they are so happy today, everyone. Okay. Did you expect so you, did you, expect you receive this much acceptance after the loss? Yeah, to me, yes, I would say yes, because, um, because, uh, because literally the way um, the Mr. President said, he said he would really try our best. So, but it's up to him, like, um, to show this um, appreciation to us. But I really appreciate him so well. I really appreciate him so much. Like, um, to be really honest, um, he really tried for us. To be really, he showed that. We, we, we worked in um, Africa, so I appreciate it so much. Well, what's your, prepared, what's your preparedness about, towards the World Cup qualifiers? There about online um, threats to you as, uh, as, as concerning your exploits against South Africa. So the question is, are you going back to Chippewa United? Um, uh, definitely, I, I must go back to my club. But talking about the threat, um, um, it's a football. You can't, you can't threat someone that wins you because they always they, they win someone also. So what about um, if, um, if you, now you win some other team and they keep trusting your players So It doesn't make sense. So it's football. So I, I don't feel like it's something attached to it. Maybe it's just someone just write up something, but it's cool to me like, because I spoke. No, I spoke to my, I spoke to my chairman um, not quite long, like three days ago, but he didn't say anything like related to all those stuff. So he felt like, no, it's cool. You, you, you come back. Because definitely I must go back to my club because they owe me. So. All right, congratulations. Thank you so much. Thank you. Osime, please. Thank you to, to be here. I, the last time I came here was in, uh, I think, 2017, when Buhari was still the president. Feels good to be to be in presence of the of, uh, of His ex Excellency, uh, Mr. Bola Metinumbu, and uh, give us some some honors and everything like that with his uh, word of encouragement. I think um, this is uh, also a booster for us to to continue to work out, to put our nation on the map and make our, make our nation proud. And um, the, unfortunately, there has been an incident with Alex Urobi and Captain Musa had to do a long thread, which I saw some of you reposting. In fact, almost all of you reposting. What is the message to Nigerians concerning cyberbullying and what has happened? It's really sad what uh, what is going through for the past, uh, I think, two weeks now. Um, some of our fans should do better, just like I said in, in my Instagram story. And of course, you can see there is a big solidarity in the team. And I urge a lot of Nigerians that cyberbullying... Uh, players because we are also human. Sometimes we make mistakes and sometimes we have a good game and we get the hype. But of course, uh, when you criticize, you have to be constructive when doing these type of things. I, I think, um, to be fair, uh, what, they, what they've done to, to Alex is, 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 is out of this world, is not good. They should also uh, look at his mentality because there are some of us that can, that can take this to heart and then keep on grinding. And there are some of us that this thing will get to our, to, to our head and then we lose focus and we lose, and we lose form. So I think uh, we have rallied around, around him. We have spoken to him individually and collectively. So I think uh, he's, a strong, he's a strong dude and he's, he's, he's ready to continue to, to, to give himself for his nation. How prepared are you for the World Cup? We are ready. We are ready. I think now we, we just finished a tournament that, that is... Uh, one of the most hardest I've been, uh, we have played in since I, since I started my career. And now we have to go back to our club to keep up the good work and hopefully we get called up by, by, our, by our national team and give our all also. And of course the goal is to, to get a ticket to the World Cup and I think uh, we have the team and we have the squad to, to achieve that. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.